if you think you're having a bad day, at least you didn't lose your phone like this guy. Look at this. Embarrassing. <laughs> hey, you know what? It means you had a good nap. That's what that means right there. You had a great nap. Hopefully you're wearing sunscreen. Uh, maybe it's a good thing you lose your phone. Losing your phone is not the worst thing to ever happen to you. Get off social media. You might miss a few Z education episodes, but you can catch up when you get it back. Take a break. Relax. Get off the, the screen time. Happy Thursday. Welcome to Z education and welcome to another episode of Try Not to Laugh. We're going to jump right into this one. There's no punishment as usual. Right after I tell you one last time about Get Upside, you guys, there's a June 25th deadline on this. So this is the last time we'll be plugging this. If you download Get Upside and you use our code, the code right here, you will get $11 off the next time you fill up your gas tank. And if you refer a friend, you will get an extra $11 off and they will also get an $11 off. So you got to use that by June 25th. Download Get Upside, use our code, support Z education without giving us money and give yourself some money at the same exact time. So if you are ready for today's game, head down and like this video. And if you are new here, please make sure you are subscribed and have the bell clicked for notifications when new videos are uploaded. Now on to today's game. Try not to laugh. Go. All right, what do we got here? <laughs> well, I got to see your face when you're doing that. That is a hilarious uh, jump scare. <laughs> what did she have there? A freaking watermelon? That's all right. You can toss watermelon. That stuff is nasty. Especially if there's seeds in it. You got to get the seedless ones. Come on. When my wife gives me the task to get our daughter ready. Oh, that should be good. Our daughter. <laughs> I see no problems here. Look, you're doing your daddy duties. If you get ready and she looks presentable, that's ugly. Yes. Presentable. Also, yes. Guys, there's this new challenge going around and it's it's a good one, ready? Okay, so when you're driving, right? When you're driving like on the highway and you're in the left lane, if you're going 60, get the f out of the way! I feel the anger. I feel the passion for justice, all right? And I love it. I love it. Don't be that person. But we need a name for these people. Maybe there already is. Maybe I, I just, I don't realize it. Idiots, yeah. Idiots. Never two putting again. <laughs> hey, that kid is like, what, just over a year? This is why you bring your babies to the course. A, you teach them young. You teach them a lifelong fun thing to do. Hopefully they get good at it. B, this counts. That That is a one putt. That is, that it's true. Glenn, you have one guess to guess what I'm putting in your hand. Glenn, you have one guess to guess what I'm putting in your hand. I feel like it's gonna bite me. It's not oh, gonna yuck. bite you. You ready? It's wet. Yeah. It's not Ew. wet. Well, I thought it was gonna be food, so I'm instantly oh. disappointed. Oh. Is it? Is no, it no, 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 stop him! Don't do that! Jeez! Ew, what the hell is your problem? It's a thermometer. It isn't even what oh, it is! My. It's not a thermometer. Oh, no. Is thermometer your guess? I don't know. Can I not take the lid off? Well, I probably wouldn't. Oh, no. Just tell him. Oh, <laughs> the smell is very distinct. <laughs> what is on my hands? I'm just realizing there's pee dripping on it. <laughs> what do you mean? This isn't going according to my <laughs> Hey! <laughs> oh! A second. <laughs> you didn't watch the part you peed on. Oh, oh. Ugh. Ugh. It didn't quite go according to plan, but congratulations. Congratulations on the baby. On the next reveal, on the next child. I maybe do it a little differently. Uh. Ugh. 
It's honestly so rogue that 100 years ago, 14-year-olds lie about their age so they could fight and die on foreign soil halfway across the world in a war they knew nothing about. And like now, people will be in their mid-20s and will only make a reservation at a restaurant if it's got an online booking system because they get too anxious about having to call up to reserve a table. Wild. Yeah, we uh, mm. live in a weird time, that's for sure. If you have to do that, you get anxiety for calling places. Got to get out and socialize a bit. Socialize your kids, folks. Socialize. Don't be a, a person that can't call a location to see if they have reservations. <laughs> How my frugal boyfriend saves money on his bananas. What? He's not being serious, though. A banana? You know, I'm, I'm all for saving money. I am. Truly. But if you're doing that, that's uh, that's over the line. What do you, save 10 pennies? When you shank your chip shot in the shootout. Hole number one chip off. Nice pinks. It's going to be bad. Of course. good front row. I got it. I got it. Always record your friends that throw clubs. Make sure you record them and you post it online. That's what they get. And it's entertainment for everyone that's, that's depriving the internet of what it deserves. Depriving all of us for what we deserve. The meltdowns. The golf club tosses. We need this. This is entertainment. My wife, every time I can't find something. Are we out of ketchup? No, it's on the bottom shelf. That's where I'm looking. Next to the yogurt? I'm telling you, it's not here. Hold on. Revelio. Where's ketchup? It was not there. It was there. Wholesome. Wholesome TikTok. Also, something that we don't talk about enough. Women do have this superpower. I swear to God, this is this is a thing. I just saw my mom do it to Neve the other day. We're at her house for dinner, and all of a sudden, Neve couldn't find something in the back. The cheese sticks. Couldn't find the cheese sticks. She's like, it's top shelf, bottom corner, two inches back behind the pickle jar. And there it was. But he looked for like five minutes. I, I'm telling you, it's a thing. I don't know what it is. You guys have a superpower. Why he confusing Gloria? Hey, Gloria. Who's talking? This is Ronnie. Who says how you doing? I'm not home. What you what? got? What do you have? <laughs> Is that a package? I'm talking Get to off Ron the phone and talk to me. <laughs> she has no idea. Wait a minute. What? Talk, talk to the doorbell. You, you want me to ring the doorbell? Grannies, they uh, they have no idea. They're still a little bit behind. She'll catch up. By the time she does, though, it's like Facebook. By the time she gets Facebook, it's not cool anymore. Ring doorbells. When she gets one, we'll move on to something else. Who knows? Hey, Bailey. What's the joke of the day? Why should you never fight a dinosaur? Why? Because you'll get giraffe kick. <laughs> Hate that I'm about to say this. That was a good one. The 54-year-old suspect is still in the Dallas County Jail this evening. With 250,000, 250,000, I'm sorry, 250,000, a quarter of a million thousand dollars, but I'm sorry, a quarter of a million bond. <laughs> the suspect told police. Is that, uh, is that Joe Biden's granddaughter? Can we play the, the Joe Biden clip? Or 50 million, billion, quadrillion. Somewhere between 700 billion and a trillion, 300 million, billion dollars. When she stops explaining where it is and starts walking over to show you. Oh, again? This is it. <laughs> dude. Dude. This is... I'm telling you, you guys. This is a thing. It's a universal thing. It is. 
What is your secret, ladies? Huh? What's your secret? My husband is so creative. I mean, how creative is this? He put shock in the pool last night, which I'm very grateful for getting the pool ready for me today. And, you know, on his way into the house, he thought, I'm going to stick this here. I mean, that's going to hold it in place and it's not going to blow away. I mean, that's such a smart idea. And then he walks in the house and, I mean, the trash can is right here. And it's automatic. And he just has to throw it in. But, I mean, I think that's just such a more creative idea. How about you cut the sarcasm, huh? Maybe he's not done with it. Quit moving our stuff. Quit moving our stuff. If you leave it, you're going to move that, aren't you? And now he's gonna, not going to know where it is. He's going to use it for something. And then uh, he's going to be looking all over for it. He's going to ask, and you're going to say it's in the trash. I've seen it a thousand times. Non-binary people, when they realize balloons are filled with helium and not they... Oh, my God. I almost died. <laughs> I almost died. That was so scary. Thank you. <laughs> It's okay. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. <laughs> oh my God, I almost died. I'm more so I'm at the... Was so it Parks and Rec? No, not Parks and Rec. What's that show called? I don't even know what it's called. Workaholics, right? But that guy, Divine, I think his name is. Freaking hilarious. Point of view. You are a dad sneezing. <laughs> if you're a dad and you don't do this, you are not utilizing one of your superpowers. This is something that we all do. You get it when you turn into a dad. You get to sneeze really loud. When the homeowner is the first to fall asleep. What do you want? Uh, I've got a great selection. Mm, that is. There's that meme of the kid. You know, the kid does it. He's pissed off. because he, And then he goes to his parents and does this to the, the cans. But if you're just at a friend's house and they happen to fall asleep first, and this is what you do to them, for bringing you into their home, Shame on you, man. Shame on you. There's a good prank idea for you. Good way to mess with someone. One more time. Do not laugh at that. <laughs> he bounced. He bounced. It's okay. He walked it off. He walked. He landed on some mud. Like, come on. He's okay. Uh, excuse me. Uh, where do I find the PVC I'll pipe? Hold this guy. PVC pipe. That's gonna be in uh, plumbing aisle 16. Oh, okay. Thank you. Appreciate it. Excuse me, sir. Sir. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's good. That's good. Make sure to make sure to tip the people that answer your questions at Home Depot, Menards, all those places. They deserve fifty percent tip. That one seasoned employee that's been with the company ten plus years. <laughs> I'm glad to see this guy's okay. Made it out to a Lakers game, huh? Man, you guys all know that. You guys all know the seasoned employees. They see the, they're the full time guys, and they see the seasonal workers coming, coming and going. And you're one of the new seasonal workers, and they don't like you. Yeah, no, it is what it is. My husband just received the most hilarious voicemail from his grandma. Luke, hey, sweetie, this is Nana. I hope your uh, your phone's working okay. I can't get hold of your mom, but we just watched the weather, and it looked like Austin got hit really bad. Well, call me if you can. Um, my number is 512... I forgot my phone number. <laughs> I am calling Luke. I can't get anybody. <laughs> Gotta love Granny. Uh, granny, if you you happen to stumble upon this, any Granny out there, you don't need to leave your number in the voicemails anymore. Caller ID is universal now on every phone, only in Alaska. Oh, hell yeah. He went out shed hunting. He found himself a, a nice shed. That's what I'm talking about, man. And he made use of it. You use the whole carcass. So you don't waste it. Gave its life for you. And he's making use of it. Hell yeah. My husband cracked the damn code on me. 
he got home from overtime yesterday and he was like, I'm starving. I'm going to order Mexican food. What do you want? And I was like, I just ate with the baby. I'm not hungry. I don't need anything. And he looked at me and he went like, what do you want? And I was like, no, like I'm good, babe. I'm, I promise I'm good. I'm fine. Yeah, you do. I said, I'm fine. 20 minutes later, DoorDash shows up and um, his food, of course, smells delicious and the regret sits in in my soul and I don't say a thing because I I made my bed, I need to lie in it, all right? We're not gonna, I don't want to hear that I told you so. This is how I know I have a soulmate because the first thing he pulls out of that bag was a burrito, not for him, for me. He said, here, because I was holding the baby, he's all, here's mom's burrito because I know what I'm fine means. It means I'm going to be hungry when my food gets here and no, I'm okay means just a bean and cheese burrito. It just, it always means a bean and cheese burrito and he's not wrong. Okay. It does always mean I want a bean and cheese burrito. Fellas, this is, that's some life advice right there. Always get her something. She said, nope, I'm not hungry. I promise you I will get her something every time every time especially if there's a young baby in the house or she's pregnant always get her something because her mind will change that, that's a fact when you finally start organizing your stuff and find everything that went missing so one day i went out and i bought this tape measure which i lost so then i bought this tape measure which i lost which i bought this tape measure which i lost which I bought this tape measure that I lost. And then finally I bought this tape measure and I didn't lose it. And then <laughs> I found all of them and now I have five tape measures. Hey, you can lose four and be good still. So you set yourself up for success in the future. All right, bagel, what the hell's that? You spend $39 to cut up a bagel? Come with me to the kitchen. Come here, come here. I got my bagels right here. Hold on. Yeah, that's pretty absurd, man. Honestly, like, you get your bagel. Uh-huh. One of these knives. Yep. Yeah, I wouldn't recommend this a butter knife. This is the butter knife from, from the dollar store, girl. Yeah, well, you can do Cut that. Cut that boy open. Mm-hmm. It's going to take you, like, 10 seconds. You don't got to buy. You don't got to go buy that expensive girl. And bam. It ain't perfect, but slap your thing on there, put it together, eat it, and you gonna be fine. He's right. He's right. Stop wasting money. Better yet, stop inventing dumb things that we don't need. Junk. That's junk. When I put my passport in the washer while I'm studying abroad. You shut up! Oh no. I'm so scared right now, <laughs> you shut up! <laughs> Another great movie clip. But, uh, ooh, I hope you call, maybe call the embassy. I don't know what you do if that happens. If you're going abroad, maybe that's a good thing you should know. If this happens to your passport, what do you do? You know, <laughs> that's kind of important. And, and what are you doing though? What are you doing with your, your passport in your pocket? You keep that in the safest place you can find while you're traveling. What is it? What, what are you doing? It doesn't make any sense. When you bought a 65 in TV to watch sports, but you're a dad. TV ain't yours anymore. Give that bad boy up. Or you just wait till they're not around. That moment when it's a Monday in late May as a teacher. Um, two Splendas and extra milk. And then can I get, what do you want? Um, Kelly, I, I don't think that's the speaker. Oh. I think it's the trash can. Oh my God. <laughs> that's real. Um, yeah, you need a break. You need a summer break. But try try showing this to someone who has a full year-round job. I know all you teachers are out there like, you don't understand. You don't have, you have no idea. You get the summers off, okay? You get, stop. You get weekends off. You get the breaks. Don't, don't even, don't even start. When your nurse says, call us if you need anything. Can I help you? Hey. Do you know which station Hallmark's on? Let me look and see. Thank you. It's supposed to be on 39. 30. 39. Okay, thank you. They said anything. And you know what? Shame on them for not having the Hallmark channel already turned on. If you have a granny or know a grandma, they love the Hallmark channel. That's just the fact. So every granny hospital room should be turned to Hallmark. Best cake ever? 
What the heck? <laughs> is it the best cake ever, though? Is now you can't eat the cake. cake? <laughs> where are those dollar bills been? You don't know. Going. You know where a lot of those dollar bills been. You know. You know. Kinda. Kinda. That's not that much money. You can go buy a new cake that you can eat. I don't think you're going to be eating this one. I don't like that. I don't support that. No one. Me when the pump says, see cashier. <laughs> hey, what did I just say earlier? You got to get out. You got to force yourself in there. Force yourself to socialize. You feel a little bit anxious. You got to just do it. Scary moment while filming our last episode. Tony. Dude, 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 dude. Okay, calm down, oh, calm down. Shut up! Free solo got wrong. Oh no. Where do I put my hand? Dude, where do I put my hand? Dude, I can't. I can't. I don't want to do it anymore. Okay? <laughs> For a second, I was kind of scared, actually. You ever seen those videos with the guys free soloing? That's terrifying. I don't like. Uh, a lot of people die like that, sadly. That guy almost bit the dust there. You're not going to believe oh, this. Yes. It's called sound bites. Flashback. And it makes sound and music inside your head. No way. Flash. Yes way. It's Try Pete. it. It's Pete from Pete Pete. I remember this commercial. Sound into a candy pop. Why is this in our video? Your ears. This is We're keeping it in. Then winning the Super Bowl. Any 90s kid. No way. How many? There it is. John Elway. How many memories does this bring back? Look at this. Wow. This what a stupid product. And you know Simulated what? They probably made hundreds of thousands, maybe millions it. off it. I guarantee it. Oh, yes. 90s, the good old days. My neighbor, Lazy. Are you serious? Are you serious? You're going way too fast. How are you going to get every... Oh, my. That is ridiculous. I don't, I, I don't support this either. These Conor McGregor signatures. What the hell? What in the hell is that? That's really what you do. Look, I like Conor McGregor, but this is uh, this is a little bit lazy. I got to say that. Don't kick my ass. Uh, and I have to say that the Mayweather fight, you guys scammed us. You did. You had never had a chance. You knew that. He knew that. But you both made millions. You You did it. I digress. Give me the biggest net you can. Good one. Ooh, you better get the net, Mackenzie. Give me the biggest net you can! <laughs> I'm not the Give me the you biggest the net, net you girl. Can. <laughs> oh, please be huge. Give me the biggest net you can. Oh, the you can. Sure. That's, a, that's a dandy. That's actually not bad. <laughs> Kenzie, come here, turn around. What do you think? Holy crap. I don't care. I'm going to fish. Give me the biggest net you can. <laughs> nice work. Nice, nice job reeling that bad boy in. What is the best thing you ever stole from a restaurant? Are you serious? Nice. Little kleptos, dude. Every family has a klepto. And uh, who is it? Is it you? Do you steal this kind of stuff? Get out of here. Stop doing that. Although those do seem like they would come pretty handy. How adults show they're full. Okay. He's going to flash to a kid. How toddlers show they're full. That's so true. We have that exact same thing. Yeah, they, uh, hmm. That's what they do. The most embarrassing thing anyone could ever do is what I did just post to Instagram and it syncs to your Facebook account. So it's a normal Facebook post like I post there. And then everyone's aunt and grandma and mom's friend says nice things, but they really think I'm posting there. I don't post there. This is why you should delete your Facebook account. Hey, look, I know we're hypocrites. We have a, a Tyler Zed page there. There's a Z education page. There's a Z education brain trust Facebook group. But you know, if you're 20, 25, you don't want to post there, just don't have one. What's a culturally significant moment in history that you still think about regularly? I don't have a 
have a problem with selfies as long as you ask me first. I actually don't like signing my name anymore because my hand gets a cramp. But if you want me to vote for you... You're not famous. <laughs> 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 That's funny. You're that famous? Wasn't she uh, kicked off the view pretty much? I don't even remember, but... Yeah, hey, you're, you're that famous? You're on some crazy talk show? Literally half the country thinks you're nuts, but... And you're that girl that was on Nickelodeon a long time ago. Most people forgot. You you make so many autographs, your hand gets tired? Get out of here. He got a nicer kitchen than me. Hey, girl got the... The four bedroom. What? You feel me? Cause I got the with the kitchen. You feel me? Cause I got the the wood grain floor. You're kidding me. You feel me? Got the carpet in that bitch. Got the lounge. You feel me? I need got the the bedroom, the beat it up section. You feel me? Hey, he got the beat it up. That's his living room. You feel me? To come to the kitchen. You feel me? He got the full setup in this joint. Cause MTV, how I'm living. I don't know how I feel about that. It's got a nicer setup than freaking most people. Living on the street. Homeless. Where's he getting all this stuff? That's what I want to know. Is this Gran Turismo? Where is this? Jeez. Did the guy on top win? <laughs> break the game in half. Take the CD out, break it. If it's one you downloaded, smash the Xbox, quit playing. That's that's a sign right there. How'd you do in today's video? Did you laugh at all? If you did, you lose. All it means though is you gotta watch on Sunday and test yourself again, because there's no laughing in these times. We know this. Also, be sure to get your GetUpside app, your GetUpside promo code, and save yourself $11 next time you fill up, possibly $22 if you refer a friend as well. You gotta do that by June 25th, so make sure you do that soon. Let me know how you did down in the comments. While you're down there, please like this video. Please help us get it recommended to others. That's it for today's video. Until next time, I'm Tyler Zed. This is Education. 12, 15, oops, stepping on them. There's a, it's black, anyway. Idiots. Drinking a soda. Do not put this in here and expose me as a hypocrite.